Many Microsoft Teams users complain their computer sometimes blue screen when using the desktop application. Now this usually indicates that the system crashed due to a non-recoverable error. So if you're also looking for a solution for this problem, follow these steps that we have for you in this video. As the first solution, make sure your GPU and camera drivers are up to date. Do that by launching the device manager, locate your display adapters, then expand the list of drivers and right-click on your GPU driver, then select Update Driver. For the next solution, enable the USB Video Device Driver. Do that by launching the Device Manager again. Go to Imaging Devices, right-click the Integrated Camera, then select Update Driver. Then, select Browse My Computer for Drivers, Choose the second option, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer, and then select the USB video device option. You might also need to update your application. And to do that, all you have to do is select more options or these three dots, select check for updates, and wait for the process to be completed. Now a number of users also solve the problem by turning off the hardware acceleration. And to do that, what you should do is go to Settings, locate the Hardware Acceleration checkbox, and then select on it to uncheck it. And lastly, delay the GPU requests. And in order for you to do that, type in regedit in the Windows search bar, and then hit Enter. Now you have to navigate to the following key and then hit enter. Then right click on the right panel and select new. Choose the word value. Name it TDR delay. And then double click on it. Edit its value and then set it to 10. After that, Launch your Microsoft Teams and check if the Teams BSOD crashes persist. Now those are the different ways on how you can fix the Microsoft Teams blue screen errors. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.